I think it's going to be very cloudy when the thing starts, so that won't uh, exactly encourage the people here. And as people flocked to their different vantage points, thick cloud covered most of the southwest. I don't rate the chances at all, really. It looks very thick cloud and, uh, well, it's worth coming here anyway because it's such a beautiful place. Some seem determined to take a rather dim view. Well, I'm playing golf from uh, 9.42. And uh, about an hour and a half after that, we shall have the eclipse. What's going to happen? I've got no idea. We've got some glasses in case we have to use them. Uh, but we're basically playing golf. Well, I think the day is an enormous bore. I'm going to play golf. We're probably going to get a torch and a candle. And I hope I don't sprain my ankle in a sandpit bunker. I've never, never seen in the last 50 or 60 years quite such a pantomime as going on now. Well, I think it's as bad as the millennium and political correctness. So we're hoping for a bit of clear sky, which we haven't got at the moment, unfortunately. All I can say is it's been disrupting everything. We get disrupted anyway in the summer, but it's even worse than usual. Here at Menon Toll, near Penzance, in the pouring rain, the Guardians of the Stones perform their rituals in the run-up to totality. I think some of the poor old uh, Cornishmen thought they were going to make a million, and uh, unfortunately, uh, people got frightened about coming down here because of the crowds and haven't booked properly in the guest houses and things. So you can imagine that they're you know, a bit uh, miffed about the whole thing. I feel so high, I even touch the sky. Got to have Kaya now. It was rather better than I expected it. I thought, well, this is going to be a completely anticlimax. At the very, very last moment, the uh, penumbra showed up through the clouds. Well, first we didn't saw any sun. But luckily, we just get a glimpse. Thank God for the arts. The people up here would be so disappointed. Well, we were looking, we were looking uh, up at the sky and we saw a quick flash of the um, beginning of the eclipse, just through a little tiny gap in the, in the clouds. And then we saw all the lights go up as it got dark in, in Padstow uh, and all manner of uh, colours, really exciting. And it was a great, uh, it was a great feeling. Of the most important thing was we drank some marvellous Verve Clicker. It, it just made me feel like it, it shouldn't be right. And uh, even if the weather wasn't fine, we didn't see the sun, it didn't matter. We should have appreciate the beauty of nature. Not na nothing beat nature. Nature is the greatest thing of all. But we did get our money's worth but, but by seeing the, the, the actual eclipse just for those two seconds before and after, but nothing else after that. One realised what Shakespeare meant when he said, the crow makes wing to the rookie wood, good things of day begin to droop and drowse. In fact, while we were playing on the tenth tee, a lot of rooks went to bed. They were rooks, not crows, but there we are.